Hi, Miss Courtney's class. It's Miss Annabelle with another art project. Do you remember when we were in art and we talked about what an architect does? If you remember what an architect does, whisper it into your elbow. It design, a person who designs buildings. Did you hear me? Did you say a person who designs buildings? Well, today you're gonna be an architect and design a new house. So here's my finished house. And all I used for this were things I found around my own house. So the first thing to do is gather a bunch of stuff. So I have a cardboard box from cereal that I'm gonna use for the background of the house. And then I found some paper scraps and some buttons and Q-tips and pasta and some rocks and stickers and a bunch of other boxes but you just need to find things around your house. But I would ask your mom or dad before you start taking things to make sure it's okay. And then with your big box, you're gonna first draw out the shape of a house, which is basically a rectangle on the bottom with a triangle on the top. So once I have that shape, I can cut it out and so you also need scissors for this project. And if you have glue, that's great. Or you can even use tape. Um, so whatever you have around, try to use it. Okay, so once I cut out my house, you might need a little help if your cardboard is thick. Um, the way I made my door pop out, I just cut one side and then I turned and cut another side. And then I can open the door and have it still there. Or you can cut the door out all together. And then I just started gluing things on to make an interesting new house. I even included a little dinosaur that my daughter made to look like he lives in the house. So have fun. Oh, one other thing I forgot to mention. If you are using glue, remember what we used to say in class? A little dab will do ya, too much will glue ya. So don't get glued. Have fun, be creative, and I'd love to see what you come up with. Bye.